What up, darlings? Welcome back. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. How are you guys doing today? I really hope extremely well, because if you're not, we gotta fix that. What you feeling? Are you feeling sad, mad, happy, glad? You gotta let me know, because I wanna help y'all. Um, so anyway, like genuinely. Uh, anyway, I am back. I am literally better than ever. I feel so good. Um, I was out, like I told you guys, I was gonna be out for a few weeks because I had to get surgery for health reasons. The health reasons was crushing rib cages and it was shooting pain down my back into my legs, not letting me sleep for years upon years. It's just, you know, it is what it is when you have a big chest. So yes, I had a breast reduction surgery July 22nd. Uh, my surgery started like at 10.40, it was supposed to start at 11, but mm, we about to, you know, get it done around her. Anyways, if you hear a fan, that's because it's 107 million degrees. Not joking. Not joking. Let me, let me just show you. <coughs> let me just show you. It is 12.51 p.m. And it is, right now, 94 degrees at 12.50. It is supposed to get... 204 can you see probably not but it's there witness moving forth with life I'm gonna tell you the story before I get sidetracked like always so I had plastic surgery no I didn't <laughs> I always keep saying I have plastic surgery I got fake boobies no I don't they're not boobs they're real they're just cut up so surgery started at 1040 ish it lasted like three hours I'm pretty sure three hours. Um, the process before, I got real nervous because, you know, you got an IV and they're pumping you with fluids. You're thinking about the surgery. The only thing that I was afraid of was not coming out of the sleep. Coming out of the sleep. Like, I didn't care about the surgery itself. I cared about, like, I'm going to like that dream world too much that I'm like, mm, bye guys, I am not waking up. So that was, like, my worry. But anyway, the funniest thing is, okay, so... I get to the hospital, get everything situated, IVs in, wait like 45 minutes, go to the bathroom, get all prepped. Girl forgot to shave her legs, so she had to apologize to everybody. I was like, girl, I forgot to shave my legs, so please don't judge me. <laughs> they just start laughing. And then I was like, I'm the person, I'm extra. I'm the person that came with the full face of makeup. Not this. This is too much. Just like, you know, like a basic, just everyday makeup. Because I'm like, I want to look cute when I come out of surgery, okay? Don't judge me. You don't know me. You don't know my life. So, we get back. Um, so, I get back from the bathroom. <laughs> Jump. I get back from the bathroom, and I'm chilling. And everybody knows when you get nervous. Well, at least me. Holla, if you're the same. You get nervous. You got grumblies in your tummy. You gotta go to the bathroom. So that's what happened. Do you know Yeah, I know. But I'm letting you know the process of things, okay? Okay. So uh, <laughs> get back on, laying on the bed, and the girls come in. My nurse was literally the best person. Her name was Chris. Holla at you, Chris from uh, Legacy Hospital, Salmon Creek Legacy Hospital. How you doing? Girl, you are the bomb. You need a raise. I already put it on that comment card. So if you see this video, holla. Okay, anyway, <laughs> sorry. So I'm getting all, you know, ready, and then she comes in, she's like, okay, and then like the an anesthesiologist, ah, oh, look at that, uh, comes in, she introduces herself, hey, I'm blah, 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 I'm going to be knocking you out today. <laughs> and I'm like, okay, <laughs> cool. So um, I get rolled back. I'm like, bye to the person that has been there, and I appreciate him. He, she, it's a she, he. You guys will know shortly, or or soon, what <laughs> the situation is. But anyway, that person was there for me throughout the entire thing. So shout out to you. I you know who you are. Uh, I appreciate you. You're freaking amazing. Uh, I couldn't have done this without you. To be honest, I would have been very miserable and lost. But anyway, thank you. Uh, moving forth, I'm getting rolled back and the girls back there are like the cutest things. They're like, oh my god, your eyelashes are so pretty. And I'm like, thank you. And they're, I don't wear false ash, eyelash ashes. Take one. I do not wear false eyelashes. So they were just mascara. And they're like, mascara? 
that is not a word. But anyway, there was mascara on them. And so she was like, your eyelashes are so pretty. And then I roll into the surgery room and there's like 20 other girls. Like, I'm like, oh, I'm like, what are you guys doing? And then they're like, oh my God, you're just like the sweetest thing ever. Because I was like super nice to everybody. And so, uh, any hoosies, moving forth, because I talk too damn much. I, the last thing I remember is them girls like, we will not rip your eyelashes out. And I'm like, what are you talking about? And I was out like she's like, okay, you're gonna she put some pump some right into the IV of mine She was like you're gonna feel something really weird in like two seconds and I'm like, oh Literally my whole body was just like Mrrr. And I'm like, oh, okay, cool. This is the first time ever going under on anything So this is why this is such a weird experience And then they moved me to the surgery table and then she's like, hey, uh, breathe into this for like two seconds And I'm like, okay, and then I was out the funniest thing is, I felt like I was out for like two seconds, I was out for three hours, and then I wake up. Should you not, like I said, forgive my language, I just talk like this, um, shit you not, I legitimately wake up, like my eyes, like I'm just, I'm like, who in the hell are you, like I'm like, who are you, cause I'm hearing my name like, Chris, and I'm like, who, like I wake up, my eyes are open to some strange woman, and I'm like, she's feeding me ice chips ice chips and I'm like who the hell are you and I'm like oh my god I'm so sorry I did not mean to say that hi like I came to be where I was at and I was like I like looked down and I was like where's my when is my surgery she starts laughing she's like you're out and I looked down and I'm like oh my god where are my boobs <laughs> they're gone well anyway so the surgery went well I'm I recovered pretty well it was just funny it was the funny story I wanted to and I'm recovering well. Uh, the coolest thing is back in the day I could not wear a dress with no bra. And I know this is very strange, but I can wear a dress with uh, no bra because my boobs are up. They're tiny now. They are a C, I'm pretty sure, which is ideal to me because that fits my body type. I have um, so much stuff coming up for you guys. Like, I am beyond pumped. I am going to Vegas. Well, I booked the trip to go to Vegas for my friend's 21st birthday, which is still happening, but I also booked a lot of fashion-oriented stuff down there, so I'll be working, getting really, really, just, you know, glammed up. Um, things are going to be changing. My style is going to be changing for the best. I feel confident. I feel beautiful. I just feel good. I know, like, a small surgery makes a difference for me, but I just, I can't. Like, it just really makes me extremely happy, and, um... I hope you guys can enjoy the, oh, I just picked a scab. Dang it. <laughs> um, hope you guys can enjoy, um, come on, Krista. I hope you guys can enjoy the future um, videos coming up, the future content coming up. So thank you guys so much for watching this babbling video of myself telling you about my surgery. Um, typical me. But anyway, you guys have a flippin' wonderful day. And let me know how you guys are doing. How How's life been? How's the summer been for you guys? If you have summer, if you're in a different country and you don't have summer, how's your winter? I don't know. Is it winter? Fall? How was your seasons? And are you guys excited to go back to school? I am excited to go back to school. Because I hated school. Just like I don't know what I'm doing. Should I do a back to school video? I don't know what I'd do. Like a fashion one? That would be cute, but like extra, like if you're like an extra girl, like what? Baby, I'm sorry, I'm not sorry. Anyway, be sure to subscribe to this channel if you are new here and you watch this entire thing. Holy moly, kudos to you. And if you're old here, I love you so deeply. You guys are amazing. I'm still gonna just keep grinding. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Hopefully it's a bomb lookbook video. We'll see, we'll see what happens. And you guys know that I have a drone so things are gonna get lit. Okay, you guys have a wonderful day, bye.